be a myriad of things shining a light on the human passage through time. At the Cape Town Art Fair, there's more than enough on offer of the best in the country and the continent. Last year, sales exceeded 35 million rand, an indication of how the fair has grown and is fast becoming a must-attend affair in the art world. So much so that serious collectors, both local and international, are given a first glance and option to purchase before it opens to the public. It's on par with any major international art fair. The difference is only um, maybe the scale. You know, we are still a small country, our resources are still pretty much limited, but in terms of the level of production and in terms of the level of um, artistic uh, quality, I think we're there. The fair also offers young artists a platform. Installation artist Catherine de Villiers' piece, Human Car Wash, engages the senses. It's the most incredible opportunity, firstly that people are willing to invest in you and secondly that you come face to face with having an interview and very big blue microphones in your face and um, collectors walking past that you would never see otherwise except if you were travelling and artists and conversations that you wouldn't have otherwise. It's, it's really it's like a watering hole for interesting things. The fair brings world-renowned and local galleries into one space. It's only a fitting um, platform for us to be part of because it gives us such exposure and ex um, to the international market and the local market and also because our space in Johannesburg is fairly new so it also draws attention to us as a gallery space. Mariska Boeta, SABC News, Cape Town.